So yeah, guys, the bike show didn't work out too well. I was pretty quite disappointed how it turned out. Uh, being there a few years back, there was so much more um, products that they were advertising and you were able to buy some luggage and accessories. And uh, I think I haven't been uh, to the Calgary uh, motorcycle show probably for about eight years now. Uh, since uh, I came to Calgary 2013 and I went twice in a row and the bike shows were quite good but today I went and I was so disappointed there's so much garbage um, basically there's only a few major brands of motorcycles you had Yamaha, uh, Honda and Harley uh, totally BMW was not even there uh, so Blackfoot Power Sports uh, didn't show up at all how convenient uh, then if I'm looking at uh, V-Stroms and uh, Suzuki's and KTM those bikes were also not on there uh, that's quite disappointing there's a lot of other bikes that I would like to see especially the 2024 models but at least uh, here we were lucky enough in Canada that they brought in uh, the 2024 uh, Africa Twin that's a new thing that's uh, coming out for this year other than that, uh, it's not going to be probably even available in US uh, this year. It's coming up like next year too from what I'm gathering. So it's available here in Canada and in Europe. Other than that, uh, I'm sorry, but that bike show, like I didn't even bother filming too much because there's nothing really that was, was catching my eye at all. Uh, they brought in a few electric bikes, which are, those are joke. We all know, know nobody wants to ride that stuff. Uh, where, would the, where is that gonna get you? Yeah, like uh, I went and I was prepared and I was so happy actually to get a day off uh, work today because I was supposed to actually, I was scheduled to work and uh, there's me showing up, meeting my friends in there and honestly, that's not what, totally not what I was expecting.